What is going on everyone? This is Double O Face coming at you with Oh my god, what is this? Modern Warfare 3? That is right. Uh, this is a stock gameplay, just something I had uh, kinda in the kinda in the back, you know, back of the, the vault, the old vault there. Uh me just kinda going going ham with the ACR silence, ACR with kick, you know, pretty a standard setup. I kind of go ham, you know? When I use the ACR, I just bust it up. But if you are on my friends list or someone that I play a lot with on Modern Warfare 3, you are very well aware that I have just been so inactive on the PlayStation Network. Well, especially on Modern Warfare 3. I just, I don't know, I went hard and fast and just kind of burnt myself out. I should have been taking more breaks. Uh, the game just was too frustrating for me to just play as long as I did. So I'm taking a real long break with that. So people who... Uh, Dog, dog make a noise. Jeez, jeez, Barney. Shush. Make a video. Gosh. But uh, people who like playing with me, I'll definitely get back into it. I'm just taking a, a little hiatus uh, from now. And so um, the kind of gameplays that I'm going to have for you guys are going to be older ones. Um, I think I have a few saved up. Hopefully I'm going to have to look through some of my old gameplays and see what I got. Um, but I'll definitely be trying to get this out to you guys, but it'll definitely slow down a lot. You know, but what do you guys want to know what I've been doing? Because I'm a gamer. I'm a gamer, so you know I've been gaming. But if I haven't been playing Modern Warfare 3 and I haven't been playing on the PlayStation Network very much, what could I have been playing? Well, I will tell you, everyone. If you don't know, I originally started gaming on the PC, so I'm kind of a PC guy. And I think Steam is probably the single most greatest ever freaking invention ever. I love Steam, it's the best program. If you have Steam and you're on there, Alright, or if you want to play uh, anything on Steam with me, add me. I'm pretty sure Double O Face will come up. Um, if that doesn't come up, send me a message with your name and I'll add you because um, I searched my name on it. So I don't know if. Pretty sure that will work. But who cares? Anyway, I've been playing Super Monday Night Combat. Uh, and if you guys don't know, Monday Night Combat was this uh, kind of Dota, LOL, Team Fortress 2, kind of a mix. You know, you have different classes, different pros you use. And then you have the robots that go down the lanes, and you have to destroy the turrets and get to the very end and kill that. And while you're doing it, you kill the other pros. And it's pretty, pretty legit. But Super Monday Night Combat is a beta. It's in beta right now. Um, it's a closed beta, but if you just sign up on their forums, uh, you should be able to get in. I signed up and got in the exact same day. Um, but so I was watching a live stream, uh, Dutchie DC on Twitch TV. If you guys don't watch live streams, or if you do, look up Dutchie. He's a really cool dude. Um, I think he should have more viewers, but, well, that's just me. Anyway, he was playing it, so it inspired me to go get it. I've been having so much fun with this game. I can't wait till it goes completely just boom, that's the way it is. And they release it, and everything's awesome, and then you can do more with it. I'm going to have so much fun. Right now, it's kind of hard because there's not too many people, so a lot of time West Coast servers aren't up. Because what will happen is you have West, Mid, and East, and then you have the out-of-country ones. But focusing on the in-country ones... So many people are on the East Coast, so people don't join West because they see zero people. So we can never get West Coast up and running, and then East Coast lag is can be really difficult because, you know, it's lag. I mean, <laughs> a lot of times lag affects all types, all games, no matter what it is. But I've been playing a lot of that. I've been playing a lot of Team Fortress 2. Uh, if you guys don't know what Team Fortress 2, then I don't know what you've been doing with your life. It's a free-to-play Third, uh, third person, not uh, free to play first person shooter um, off of Steam. So much fun. And by the way, um, the Super Monday Night Combat is third person. So adds a adds dynamic to it. Um, but if you if you want to play, hit me up. Hit me up on Steam, and I will be more than happy to play with you guys and give you hints or whatever. But on the PlayStation side, I have not been completely inactive. I have bought a lot of games recently. Um, so on Steam, I just got uh, Duke Nukem Forever for $4.99. Gobble! But I don't have fraps or anything, so I'm not going to be doing any theft on computer. Not yet. I'm, I'm hoping my birthday's coming up. My 21st birthday's on Monday. Um, maybe I'll get some money and put that towards fraps or, you know, I'll see how that goes. But on the PlayStation side, I played the demo for Kingdoms of, Kingdom of Amalur. Which is pretty legit. If you guys haven't played that demo, go try it. Uh, a lot of people have been having glitchy issues with it. I had some glitchy issues. I was going to do a little playthrough of the demo to show you guys, but uh, there's some major glitches with the conversation. But, I mean, it's just a demo. You know, a lot of people can't even play it. It just crashes on them. So I got lucky and was able to play it a little bit. Very cool. It's kind of a weird mix of Skyrim, kind of open-worldness. Uh, but it's kind of a third-person view, and it's almost like God of War in a way, the way the combos, the combos work and the button combinations and 
Uh, you know, if you guys are fans of Captain Dave, or Captain Dave, if you happen to see this, the combat can be kind of the same. Oh, there's this Fulton there. It can kind of be the same as some of the um, Marvel stuff where you use different button combinations, whether it's your, you mix your spells with your bow and your primary, or your, your secondary can be a staff or a sword, and, it's, and the secondary is just one button click. It's pretty cool. It's kind of hard to explain. That comes out in February, so if, if you like RPGs and stuff like that, that game might be cool to pick up. Play the demo, check it out, see what you guys do. And then uh, also on the PlayStation, I got uh, Sonic 1 and Sonic 2, which is awesome. Love Sonic. And um, what was the last one I just got? I just got Hamilton's Great Adventure, which is um, uh, kind of a puzzler. I don't know. It's, it's not everyone's cup of tea, but I've been freaking loving it. So if you kind of like puzzles and trying to figure out things, uh, it's definitely the way to go. Because it's kind of like a, not really a platformer, but you try to get from one place to another. A to B. Pretty simple. But if you collect certain amounts of treasure you get a bronze silver or gold rating and you're trying to get gold in all of it but you can only step on certain tiles once or twice so you have to plan where you're going to walk around so it's a pretty cool puzzler i've been having a lot of fun with it i've been having a lot of fun with everything you know i've kind of forgotten that single player games are my forte you know the multiplayer can be super frustrating um super money combat can be frustrating but even when you lose you still have a pretty good time but yeah just giving you guys a little bit of update hope you like this beastie ACR gameplay and uh, whatnot. And uh, if you got any questions about any of those games I've been playing, let me know. If you guys want to play on Steam, hit me up. Uh, yeah, I will try to be posting a little bit more often. All right, this is Double Face signing out saying good night and good fight. Peace out, guys.